All right, we have moved over to the cooking corner where Chef Crystal is hard at work at today's recipe featuring salmon. In fact, this is the first time Chef Crystal has stood in place since we've been over here. <laughs> You've been busy. very busy. But there's, that's not all because we're also doing, uh, well, there's a lot of citrus. We're also doing a dessert. You know, it is very impressive to watch you cook a yes. whole meal before 930. I would, it we just want to say, it yes. makes it well very exciting. Well done. <laughs> Which means you can do it too. Yes, Because if I right. can get three things out, you know, you guys could definitely do it. Just one. I love that. So let's you start. inspire people. <laughs> That's what you should be. Let's we start with this good. beautiful salmon. Yes. So this is a whole side of salmon, our filet of salmon, right? So this is our nature's basket salmon. I walked up there. In fact, I have one in the cooler. Comes in this uh, vacuum packed package. You say, okay. can I have one? You get it. Don't be intimidated just because it's a whole filet it's of salmon. It's a big piece yeah. of fish. Leftovers. Oh, okay, leftovers, We're David. eating for the whole week, David. <laughs> okay. Come on. Eating in the kitchen after everybody leaves. Right. No, but leftovers. Salad, right? Okay. Another dinner. Yeah. So bowls, you can make rice bowls, you know, cauliflower rice bowls. So this is a great thing. Or if you have a big family or a party coming up, it's a nice it's way a nice to do option. it. It's a nice option. Easy, okay? So what are you doing to it? So I have some herbs here. I have some dill, some parsley, some chives in there, right? Mm -hmm. And then over here is a little Dijon mustard if you wanna scoop a little bit out there. All right. Scoop and we're just rubbing this right on here? Or well, we're gonna shove, put it into that bowl, okay. shove it into the bowl. And then I have some honey. This is the honey? Yep. Uh, no, uh, that's nope. a little bit of lemon juice. I was going to say, this doesn't look like honey consistency. <laughs> I was about to say, well, maybe I'm I tired, I was going, but to, I was going sure. to squeeze it in. There you okay. go. A little bit of honey in there. <laughs> and then that is some lemon juice. Mm -hmm. right. I'm going to take and put that lemon juice in there. That's going to help. It sure is. And how early did you put this on the salmon? Do you have to have it so, soaked in or no? You don't. I okay. wouldn't do it more than a half an hour because you see it starts to change the color. Okay. So salt right. and pepper is in there as well. And I'm going to throw a little olive oil in there, okay? Olive oil is wonderful. It is. It makes things <laughs> taste good and it gives great color, great flavor. It's awesome. Okay, so we're just so going to put this all over. You mix that up and you put that all over, right? That's beautiful technique, I oh, tell you. Oh, thank you. you know what I'm learning from you. <laughs> I can't wait to try this too. I'm, I'm coming around to salmon. I don't know that I can eat a yeah. whole thing, but eh. You that's have a true. family to share with, right? Well, that's right, you're, that's you're right. Good. But this is like a news flash, because she doesn't normally like seafood. I know. Salmon somehow has gotten on her good side. You don't draw attention to it. You just go on like it was like a natural thing. Okay. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, of course you like salmon. Uh -huh. so, <laughs> All right, orange I slices. Took orange slices and lemon slices. So navel oranges. And you know, this is the time of year for citrus. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I remember whenever you used to get citrus for Christmas. Yeah. This is stocking right. summer, right? right? So, um, and a lot of people don't know that, but this is a great time of year for it. So then you're going to take and you're going to start to shingle it. And I'm going to put it in the center because you guys are going to do some shingling. Okay, we're going right? to do some shingling? You're going to do some shingling. Is there a trick time. to it? There is an eye, you know, alternate, but you don't have to. You could do stripes of one down. Yeah. Oh. Your creativity, whatever okay. you want to do, okay? I see you have some asparagus there too. I do have some asparagus. So what we're going to do is we're going to cook this in, a, in the oven and it's a slow cooked salmon. So a lot of times I'll take my salmon and put it in 425, 450 and it's ready because I'm going through and it makes a nice crust. But this is nice because all the flavors get down through it. Mm -hmm. So after you cook this for a little bit, you take and you put your asparagus around it and then and uh, finish it off. Finish it off in the oven. And you have one that's already finished in the oven, right? I of have course one you that's do. In the oven. Yay! While you're, while you're so. pulling that out and cutting it up, can you tell us about the beautiful cake that you have here too? So that cake is an olive oil uh, citrus cake or that's orange beautiful. cake, and really easy. So no butter, but eggs. You whip them and a little bit of um, sugar in there. The orange zest. Really nice and simple, and I'm gonna take Ooh, a fork okay, and thank you. Here. Yeah. Olive oil cake, okay. I feel like I see it on menus at restaurants now. I never heard of it growing up. Right. Well, it is actually a very old dish. I mean, think about it. There wasn't really, um, there wasn't really butter, you know, for a long period of time, but you oh, had sorry. olive oil. Olives right. are one of the oldest crops around. So really, really nice. You got the big piece. Here. Oh, look at me. All right, look at that. Will she finish it? <laughs> That's great. And you're going to have so the links that. to both of these recipes, right? So both recipes are there. And I believe there's also one for a 
herb tea. So really mm. nice and simple, mint, ginger, and then orange zest. Mm -hmm. Oh, that sounds So that wonderful. would be great to go with your orange cake. And I, really and I love, I love ginger. I, oh, you have your ginger. It, in the winter time, and it just makes it a, a very lovely, you know, idea, warming, just to sit back and relax and maybe watch the game. I'm going in for dessert, and too. Thinking that we're going to mm. win, we better win. Oh, man. So this would be a great way to go, right? Wait, we're gonna, try to, we're gonna go. try to eat the cake too. There you go. <laughs> Chef Crystal, thank I'm never you, gonna turn down always. cake. Oh man, it smells so good when you're baking oh, yeah. it too. Oh. This is what what a wonderful thing that you can throw in the oven for dinner tonight. We're gonna it's have definitely. these recipes for you too online. Up next